Hello and welcome back to the channel. I am your host and Captain Morgan of the Major Six, Ken Levine. I'm a singer and vocal coach here on YouTube and today we are looking at the Exino Synergy Core microphone from Antelope Audio. But before we do that, I would just like to remind you all to please remember to hit that subscribe button, notification bell, uh, thumbs up or thumbs down. Yeah, I'm democratic that way. It helps me, it helps the channel and hey, it could help you so you don't miss out on any of the great stuff that we produce here every week on the channel. So about a month ago, I put up the call to everyone in YouTube land on my channel within this community to say, hey, I need some help. I need to solve a problem. I would like to recommend a good, decent USB microphone that's easy to use and is affordable for beginning vocal students to help maybe just up their game when they are practicing at home, when they're trying to record themselves, when they are interacting with me on Zoom. And I received a lot of input from all of you. Look at all these wonderful comments, people uh, wanting to share their stories, which was really, really helpful. And as a result of that, I received an... Uh, an invitation, a call from someone at Antelope Audio saying, hey, we have this new prosumer, prosumer, I, is that a word? I guess it is a word, uh, consumer, uh, cut above a consumer grade USB microphone that we are uh, just launching right now. It's called the Axino uh, Synergy Core, and I'm reading it off the box because they sent me one. They said, would you like to have a listen to it? And I'm like, heck yeah, I would. So here's the box. This is what it looks like on the box. Pretty fancy. Um, pretty cool. I uh, was uh, thrilled to get it in the mail. And uh, out of the box, it's actually pretty cool. You, you get um, the microphone, which you see in, in front of me right here. Maybe I can swing it around so you can see it. It comes with a handy dandy shock mount. And there's a couple of knobs at the front, <laughs> uh, uh, volume knob for your headphones, and um, I guess, and also volume knob for um, your input volume. And then, of course, it also comes, of course, it also came with this handy dandy little um, pedestal, uh, so you could just have it on your desk in front of you as you were recording or using it. And um, yeah, I thought it was uh, kind of a cool little all in one unit and to solve that particular problem. So when I plugged it in, I was surprised that when you plug it in, uh, you first are greeted with this uh, control panel. You have to sort of log it in with a special um, unique code and then you hit the control panel and up comes the control panel, which I think the one main feature that sets this particular USB mic from many, many others on the market is it uh, Antelope's unique modeling software. They have the software built into the hardware of the microphone. So wherever you go, whatever unit you're plugging into, you can, um, or, or uh, digital audio workstation, or just computer you're plugging into, you take this software with you, which is really cool because you don't just get this microphone, you get a whole host of other microphones. Um, if you want, I think this one's modeled up the Berlin 87, I think that's uh, modeled after a Neumann U87, and you can hear it sort of change in tone and timbre a little bit. Um, here's one for modeled after the SM7B, a little bit more nasal in quality, and then of course just the sort of clear tone of the Exino which is really neat, but it doesn't stop there. They also have all of these presets. If you go up to this custom window, I don't, I'm not really sure how clear this is going to be when we play this back, but um, you can choose from a bunch of different uh, vocals um, for or vocals or for it looks like for acoustic guitar. Um, if you click on this, it has some presets which could be fun to play with. Uh, here's a phone sound. If you wanted to do that, but I think for most um, for most uh, vocalists, they probably would want to just go straight to a nice, clean vocal sound, which it has already preset. And within those presets, there are um, you can see these panes, these windows. You can um, have all of these. Uh, different rack mounts, uh, different uh, compressors, and um, <laughs> stuff. I gotta tell you, I gotta admit, I'm not one of these techie guys that uh, totally, totally gets off on all of this uh, sound audio gear. I know that many people do, and it's fun to play around with. I've played around with this um, and uh, to just have a little bit of fun with it. So uh, what we have loaded up here is, um, it looks like a Neumann uh, 563. 
never played around with one of those microphones before. And what a student could do with it, I think, would be kind of interesting. You could just plug this in, and if you just wanted to practice or if you wanted to record something, uh, let's see, something like this, a little... Here's a little uh, Beatles tune if you wanted to practice something like this and sing along to uh, and record yourself and then play yourself back at a, maybe a little bit higher level than what you would get from your, uh, I don't know, your tablet or maybe your phone that you might be recording into. Okay, so I think I'm gonna utilize the switch here for the 10 dB cut because I think this is a, a loud song. I know it goes pretty high up in my range and um, when I just switch that knob, it, it cuts down 10 dB off of the, um, the gain of the microphone. And yeah, we'll just see how it sounds. Here we go. Oh, darling, by the Beatles. Oh, darling, please believe me. So there you have it. That's my quick and dirty look at the Axino Synergy Core microphone. That's our USB microphone from Antelope Audio. And of course, uh, this is a microphone that was supplied to me from Antelope Audio. And I need to, I should have said that from the very beginning, but I think I kind of did. Anyway, there you go. Uh, sponsored content, as it were. But uh, my honest opinion is that this is an interesting uh, microphone, and I think anyone would be proud to have it on their shelf or uh, in their current uh, lineup of microphones because of the modeling software capabilities that it has. If you are uh, just starting out on your vocal career and you're wanting something that has a bit of versatility, something you can play with just with your laptop, with whatever digital audio workstation that you have, um, and you want something that is going to grow with you, I think this would be a good choice for people if they're wanting to learn a little bit more about microphones without having to spend a ton of money um, researching, or researching or buying microphones, trying them out, and maybe being perhaps being disappointed, maybe having to also put in a lot of money on uh, digital audio interfaces and uh, all of that stuff. So there you have it. Yeah. Um, one thing I will say, uh, when I did get the microphone, I wasn't sure I had loaded it up properly and I did experience some difficulties at the beginning and it left me a little bit flummoxed as to what I was doing wrong. Uh, they, I reached out to them, their support team was more than happy and experienced and were able to walk me through uh, how to load up the Synergy Core uh, properly so that it, uh, you can access all of the features that are uh, within the microphone. If you are a singer who is not quite sure of what direction you want to take, I strongly recommend you reach out to a competent vocal coach. There might be one living in your neighborhood. It's the best way to learn one-on-one, -on -one, but if not, times being what they are, you can certainly reach out to one of us in YouTube land. You don't have to work with me, but if you want to work with me, I'll be sure to leave a link down below in the description as well as a link to Antelope Audio and their Synergy, the Axino Synergy Core. If you're interested, you can check it out. Okay, thank you so much. If you've made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching, and we will see you next time.